car after car, bag by bag. The house of bread packed and passed out hundreds of lunches as a way to simply say, I want to thank you so much. All the best. Thank always, you. Thank always. you. You see, it's the 36th annual Hunger Banquet in a drive through style fashion, of course. Thanks a lot. A celebration to those who've supported the organization so it can continue its work in the community. Our main mission is to feed people who are hungry, and we started out as a very, very simple organization with a few volunteers and a few dollars in our pocket. Sister Teresa Fonte, co-founder and co-director of House of Bread, says as time progressed, they've noticed something. People were coming to us in big numbers. We were 20, 30, then 100, 150. And we were seeing that people were also in need of uh, recovery programs, housing, education. Now four decades in the helping business, they've grown to meet the needs of the community. They do so much. They provide food, uh, shelter, housing. Um, they, they touch a thousand lives a day in our city. While Mayor Luke Brennan says organizations like the House of Bread, along with community support, helps Capital City thrive. Thanks for coming. Appreciate it. Thank you. Fonte says they'll continue their work to help push the north end of Hartford forward. The north end is where there is a need. The poverty is at a high, high rate here. So uh, we will continue serving the people in the area as, as much as it's needed. In Hartford. Bye-bye. Raquel Harrington, Fox 61 News.